On the little course by the lake, underneath the car route. Do you notice my signature on the lower left hand side? I had an insect in the camera and I killed it with some fly bomb. Another good entry here. The scratch men are once again Ross and Dave McLaren. That's the way to handicap them, boy. No messing around with a stopwatch. It's quite a short course, wouldn't be more than half a mile round this course. And uh, this kind of handicapping goes over quite well there. Les Worsley is driving his Spanish Voltaco machine and he's in yellow and he's determined to get up in amongst the leaders this time. He's running third at the moment. There's the field going down the so-called straight, and here's Les. He's taken the lead by the looks of it. Come on, Les. This is the little corner into the home straight. It's a bumpy straight, this one. You can see the red jerseys of Doug and Ross are gradually coming up through the field. Les is being pursued very closely by Alan Franklin here. You'll have to keep that machine going. That's the Czechoslovakian machine and a Spanish machine. The first and second. What do we see? Les is still in front. Come on, Les Worsley is holding quite a good lead, but Ross has got through now and he's after him. And Doug's after Ross. Come on, Les. Wind on, boys. Ross is right on his tail. He's got one lap to go. He gets a white flag. That's one lap to go. What's it look like? He's still in front. He's only got to get around this corner and into the winning flag. And then he overdoes it. He gives it too much throttle. And up and over he goes. And Ross goes on for a good win. Les manages to get the bike up and push in for third or fourth place. That was bad luck. It was a bad luck. He only had three yards to go. And with this shot of Les, we'll say cheerio to Carwell, 1967. <laughs>